Uh, the studios are really important to me. Um, since I was younger, as, someone, as an apprentice for a painter, I felt the studio is very close to the way somebody else might think of perhaps a church, not to try to be sacrilegious, but um, a space in which certain kind of experiences can occur. So, and I love architecture and I love building. So it's a good marriage of desires. Um, so in each, in each studio, to the extent that I was able to afford it and do it, I have, I have tried to always craft a workspace that responds to all my preoccupations as a support of the preoccupations as well as the people that come from the outside world. In this latest embodiment, I've, I've moved back between LA and, and Florida for the last five years and finally I bought a building in Miami and I did it in a way that, that included all the discoveries of the last 15 years in terms of a studio and the way I wanted for it to be in the world. And it includes things, for example, we have public lectures that we invite people from, from all over the world to come and talk there. It includes our publishing house, um, includes a summer workshop for, to provide um, artists with critiques. Um, it includes community outreach programs, as well as making my work, and as well as housing the collection and archive of my own work. So that is the studio, and all those things are the work, not just what happens at a gallery. So the building is designed to support all of that. 